Bitcoin is dumping quite a bit right here guys and if you've been watching our channel and if you also have been watching the signals that we are seeing over on World Portal then most likely this hasn't really come as a surprise to you and I think that for a lot of people this actually did came as a surprise because the majority of the people were actually bullish that was actually very clear also when we have a look at will portal and we bring out the uh, bitcoin um, data right here we can see also that over a extended period of time we have positive funding rates generally that is a bearish sign especially when we already have seen the momentum on bitcoin losing and also um bitcoin trading below key levels right because if bitcoin would trade above key levels holding very nicely a a kind of uptrend and we have positive funding and the price slowly trends up that can actually be a bullish sign but when the structure is already turning bearish and this is something we have talked about right here on the channel we have an extended period of positive funding we can expect that the um, most likely direction of the Bitcoin price is to the downside. And that's also what I have been presenting over uh, here on the channel, but also on Will Alerts. We have been very clear that yeah, over the next coming weeks ahead, we expect Bitcoin basically to continue to correct, maybe even break down of this falling wedge formation. But that doesn't necessarily need to happen, right? We could also trend down right here and form a low and then eventually continue this uptrend but a high likelihood is also that we break down uh, and then we are going to see that cycle low occurring lower than the levels right now what is more likely well to be honest guys it actually doesn't really matter because we just look at the time right so we've been right here already uh, kind of bearish saying that we are going to take some part of our bitcoin out uh, just in case bitcoin is going to see a correction because we had that cycle high right it was just a point like okay from the four year cycle low till this cycle high we actually doubled our investment why not take a small portion out of it just in case we are going to correct we might be able to buy back uh, at a better price later and that is exactly what we are seeing right now so i will wait until we are reaching this box in time so not on not based on a level only based on time and then i'm going to assess further whether i'm going to re-enter whether i'm going to re-enter alts and what basically is going on but uh, i can be honest right here i'm actually quite bullish after bitcoin will surpass this box in time so not based on price but after we will surpass this box based on time i'm going to be quite bullish again because the season of buying is starting but there is a really big but i do would love to see uh the signals over on worldportal.com um confirming that scenario as well so that's why that is so powerful when you use for example time and derivative exchange data they can complement each other and that is the important thing right here because we can actually based on time we can we have been tracking this cycle very beautifully and from the four year cycle low to this high we almost traded every move kind of perfectly even though we didn't know um, how big that move was going to be we just knew that okay based on this time the price will go down during this period and based on this time the price will go up during this period right so that was the only thing we actually knew and then you don't really know you don't have to know the exact levels right if it goes to 30k if it goes to 28 or if it goes to 40 and we just know that from this moment it most likely goes up till this moment and yeah what the level is going to be that's going to be very difficult to say like yeah it's going to be exactly 30k or it's going to be this and that it's very difficult to say so that's also what i'm doing now i'm not i'm not calling specific levels i do watch some very interesting levels of course but i'm not waiting for those levels to be hit i'm just waiting for bitcoin to uh, capitulate in time and that is when I'm going to adjust strategy again and going from a seller's perspective, what I'm already in for the last couple of weeks 
into a more buying perspective. And I will share the exact details over on World Alerts, uh, especially when I'm going to buy Bitcoin, when I'm going to long, and also when I'm going to buy altcoins. So if you are interested in that and if you want to get that extra information, guys, make sure to join with one of the affiliate links down below this video. Uh, if you appreciate these updates, make sure to leave a thumbs up, guys. That is very much appreciated. And I want to wish every single one of you a beautiful day today. I hope it is as sunny uh, at your location as it is right now in Holland, which is just beautiful, guys. And yeah, I hope to see every single one of you in the next video.